the men's 1500 meters and the race containing two men who've won gold at this distance at the Olympic Games the veteran John Walker from New Zealand the 1976 champion in Montreal and Sebastian Coe the double Olympic champion in Moscow and Los Angeles from Great Britain and in tonight's race Seb Coe the hot favorite but tough competition for him in the form of the two Spaniards, Jose Luis Gonzalez in the yellow strip and Jose Abascal. With James Mays from the USA setting a fast pace. Behind him, the Kenyan Joseph Cheshire and Omar Khalifa from the Sudan. And there on the outside of the picture, you just saw Seb Coe from Great Britain, number 184. A man with a tremendous record here in Zurich. Coe has mounted the winner's rostrum here in the Letzigrund Stadium no less than six times. Well, no change on at the back on the track in the men's 1500 meters. The two pacemakers, Mays and Cheshire, still lead the field. The main bunch is led by Omar Khalifa, the World Cup champion. Behind him, the two Spaniards, Abascal and Gonzalez. At the back of the field, Abdi Bile and Charles Cheriot from Kenya. The Cheriot, there at the far side of your picture, moving up very nicely indeed, right up the field to slot into fourth place. And the field still led by the two pacemakers, Mays and Cheshire. It looks like Mays is about to drop out, keeps looking over his shoulder. He wants Cheshire to continue the pacemaking for him. As Mays leaves the track, 205. Cheshire takes up the pacemaking, his job to bring these men through in a fast time so they can make an assault on the world record. And at the bell, 2 minutes, 39.67 seconds. And Cheshire still way out in front. Khalifa behind him. Gonzalez, the Spaniard, his fellow countryman. Abascal. Sepko still hanging back there in sixth place at the moment. Oh, and there go the two Spaniards. Abascal and Gonzalez kicking. And with them, it's Seb Coe and the man in the red vest, Steve Scott of the United States. Scott timed his run in beautifully. Keep an eye on the world record. It was set by Sider Wheater. And Abascal rattling down the track. Gonzalez is with him. Coe's at his shoulder. Scott in fourth place. It looks like it's going to be Seb Coe's race. Seb Coe, he's had so many successes, but Scott takes it. Steve Scott of the United States with a sensational finish. Pips, the double Olympic champion, Sebastian Coe, on Gonzalez, whether out of disappointment or exhaustion, tumbles and abascal.